So this is what I bought to mix our soil coming up this spring, a uh, four cubic foot electric cement mixer. Yeah, I'm not going to be starting a concrete business with this, but uh, it's good enough for mixing a bit of dirt and uh, the occasional bag of concrete. So I paid about uh, $300 Canadian, which I thought was a reasonable price. Um, I couldn't find anything used that was in and around the same price or cheaper. So I bought this. Anyway, let's get it unboxed and assembled. So this is what $300 gets you a pile of red parts, and uh, the motor in a black case, a couple of wheels, a bag of bolts and other parts, and the instruction manual. So we're going to assemble this, hopefully uh, it goes pretty easy, I'm sure it will. The instructions are supposed to be pretty good, and uh, had half decent reviews on Google, so I'm hoping it'll do what we need. So I'm hoping it's as easy as this. Step A gets those parts, step B and so on get the parts and by the time you get to the letter I, you have a fully assembled cement mixer. Okay, I had to stop and redo one thing here and in the book it does not show in the picture that that piece has four holes. So I assumed it was the top hole but it ends up being the bottom hole otherwise the unit is not level. It's out by about three quarters of an inch. The second thing is, is uh, yes it explains but there's a little circlip that goes into a groove on the bearing here or onto uh, the collar and easy enough to put on with a pair of needle nose pliers with a bit of patience and uh, on to the next step. So if you read the instructions, which I didn't, this little leather washer or rubber washer goes in between the blade and the drum and then you put the washers on top so it also helps holding the bolt in place while you're putting the mixer bar on. All right, and that's it. I got to bag eye and of the parts, and uh, sure enough, it was the last step. So really easy installation. The instruction manual is relatively easy to understand. There's a couple things you got to think through, one being the blades inside the drum, but other than that, it's pretty self-explanatory in the manual. A little light duty, but like I said, I'm just a professional homeowner. Going to be mixing some soil with this, the occasional bag of cement. So I think it'll be a nice addition. So uh, yeah, we'll check this inside of the drum. I'll show you the blades. So this is the interior of the drum. The blades, I kind of had to figure out the explanation in the manual. It's not very clear, but it's affixed to the bottom and you have to put the rubber washer in between the blade and uh, the drum and the same at the top. But this is how it's configured, worked out okay. All right, we're gonna give it a go for the first time, make sure that it works, and here we go. All right, it seems to spin as it should, and uh, 
yeah, hopefully a nice addition to our uh, landscaping gardening equipment from box to assembled. Probably about uh, two and a half hours trying to figure a few things out, I'm trying to do it by myself. Might have been easier with an extra set of hands at uh, one or two locations, but we managed. And uh, for the professional homeowner, I think it's a half decent uh, no name Chinese cement mixer that'll help us mix soil to fill several of these. And uh, we're going to be adding some raised beds to our garden this year, and we're going to be mixing soil to put in it, so it'll come in handy. All right, I think that concludes today's video. Just a quick video of an unboxing and assembly of a no name cement mixer that I got at Lowe's. I think it'll come in handy, but um, yeah, I think the manual that comes with it is uh, very good. It explains step by step. The nuts and bolts are separated by letter, so uh, you can't go wrong. And uh, we'll see how it works this summer. We'll uh, do a couple of videos on that as well as we fill our garden beds this spring and get started. But uh, we're glad that you could join us. We hope that you liked this video, and if you did, we would love it if you'd subscribe, like, and share as usual. And join us again for another video coming soon. Thanks for watching.